There we go. What's up, everyone? It's time to do some more fishing. We're gonna go out tomorrow. It's supposed to be like 30 degrees or something. We're gonna hopefully find some active perch and walleye. We're gonna move around the lake a bunch and jump holes and find some active fish. First off though, check out this custom rod holder I built today. Holds 18 rods. Everything's custom built. If you're interested, I'd probably build one for you, honestly. It's kind of fun. <laughs> oh, he's on there. It's the hardest running. It's the hardest running. He's on there. Oh, that was a good one. Too. Oh, dad. That was a good one. He was running with it too. God, he's big. He's really big. That's a walleye. Jeez. As soon as you jigged, he's he got it. out. He's spooked. <laughs> Hit and run. No, he's on. God. Little one. Oof. Ah. He's gonna have to go back. You could almost eat it. My other one was way bigger than that. Yeah. You might want to jig over here, maybe. Yep, I think I might. You had a couple hits over here now. I did. A little deeper over here. That's on a tungsten jig tip up. Dead stick. Little walleye though. Yeah, he's probably what, nine inches? Seven inches? Probably more than that. Now he's 13. It's gotta be 14 to keep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, well, we got two fish so far. Missed two big ones right at the hole. My dad's caught all of them. That's where his flag's been going up, so he moved over there. I'm gonna stay here, watch our poles, but hopefully we get some more action here soon. Little thing. Okay. Okay. 
Riv, lift this one up. Oh, I tangled it. had a school of fish come by, so you really? mean. They didn't want to bite, but... Yeah, a school of fish? Yeah, it had to have been a, more than one. Perch? Must have been that school of perch. Oh, hell. Tell them to come over here, I'll... <laughs> At this point in the video, I went inside my buddy Jamie's house. I went inside to check out his underwater camera and had my, my camera on me. Just so happened he had a good school of perch and walleye come through, so I took some video of that for you guys. It's actually you gotta cut that minnow's tail off or something. It's actually not uh where's he at? Oh he's right there. Yeah he's on this one. That hole? I'm gonna try to pop it now. Oh. oh, there's one. Jeez, you guys got all kinds of hope you hit it. There's a third one. Yeah, yep. see? Oh, that's walleye. It's walleye. He's in a wagon. Boom. 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 Not very big. Oh, there's another walleye. Just hit him. Jeez, they're here. Holy smokes. You guys got the fish here. We're coming yeah. in. Oh. Gosh, that's awesome. That's a big fat perch. Too aggressive. No, they just lose interest as soon as you. Crazy how you guys got all these perch over here though on where what 50 feet over there and there's nothing. And I thought the same thing when you were at, you know what I mean? Like Yeah. But they just roam around. Yeah, it's literally it's, like, I think it's it's just a tight school is what it is. They just don't good school. Come on. He's coming over to this one behind us. Oh he's coming over to me. Where did you go the other way? Oh, he's coming to back to you. I'm just going to let it hang. It seems like that better, Omar. Yep. Oh, there you go. I'm going to touch it. He's, he's going to. He likes that minnow shaking like that. Now it's got the perfect action. Swallowing it. Oh, he might. Is, oh, oh he, he had it for a you second missed there. The, you missed your chance. That's so crazy how they can spit them like that. Yeah, no kidding. God, split second he had it in his mouth basically. And I left the ring on there so it makes a little bit of noise. Okay, it's coming around the other side now. <laughs> says just leave it. It says I must have put the card in there. Look at that big perch. Yeah, I know, right? Isn't that cool, though? Yeah, now it's got me all fired up. I might have to walk here and put something else on and start digging. I'm trying to get that yeah. ring to make a little noise, but it's... Ooh, nice. baby. 
That's what we've been waiting for. All right, so we watched the camera over in our buddy Jamie's house. We saw that there was perch over there. We set up that tip up over there. I don't know if you can see it, but that's where my dad cut that big perch at. We're gonna try moving over there to catch some more perch, drill a couple holes over there and jig, so. All right, well, it got freezing cold out and super windy, so we had to change plans and brought the truck out on the ice and now we're fishing out of the truck. And the police, of course, do Hopefully we can scrap off a few more here before the evening. Fish on this boat, or your snag, your snag. So overall, not a bad fishing trip. We did decent, not as good as we would have liked. But as you saw from watching that underwater film, the fish were very finicky and didn't really want to bite. Um, our two hottest lures were both PK lures, the PK Ridge Rattler, this one here, and then as always, the PK Predator. The smaller, smaller size is very helpful to getting those fish to bite, especially when they're finicky like they have been. So, yeah. Hey guys, Austin Roller here with Dvorak Motorsports in Bismarck, your premier Articat and now CF Moto dealer for the state of North Dakota. Come check out the incredible lineup of C-Force ATVs like this C-Force 600 Touring.